Hi everyone! Thank you for watching this video. This is Sheva from Berry Mix Journals over at Instagram. For today, I have a craft with me video for this little project that I um, shared as my design team project for the paper cameo. If you haven't um, watched that video of me flipping through this um, ephemera basket, I'll um, put it in the cards um, now so that you can click and watch that video and then come back here to watch me um, create one. Uh, so what I will be using for today, I think I'll be using the same base uh, for the ephemera basket, but maybe I'll, um, um, I'll switch up the ephemera that we'll be adding, but I'll share those um, links uh, to the kits below as well. But before I share with you, um, uh, but, but before we do the craft with me, uh, I just want to share uh, the kit that we'll be using for today. So the base for the kit is the summer picnic um, kit that um, the paper cameo Nicola has in her Etsy shop. I'll add her link in the description below so please don't forget to check that out so that you can also craft along with me if you're interested in getting the kit. So um, what I did is I printed um, all of the kits uh, but to make the base what I did is I printed this background paper on one side and then this other background paper on the other side and what you need to do to create this um this ephemera basket is to print that twice so this uh, basket on one side and then the floral and the blue uh, background paper on the other side so those would be our base for the um for the ephemera basket and then this is another background paper as well as this one. I just printed them back to back. Um, what I'm thinking is maybe we'll create an ephemera using this paper. And then these are the pockets. So this is one page. So this one I just printed one-sided because we're going to be sticking it to the ephemera basket. Another um, pockets. And then this one is the tag um, page. So there are three tags included in the kit. This one I didn't use in the previous project, but I thought we could use it uh, for this one. I'll include it in the um, pockets. More pockets here. This is another background paper. Then this is the envelope. And then this uh, ephemera, this tag page is from the Floral Affairs kit. As well as this one. So this one, um, I printed it in a smaller size. So this page is um, as big as this one. But I printed it in a smaller size. Um, this is the first time I'm doing that, but I thought this would be cute tucked into the pockets as well. And then these two are from the labels kit. So I'll include those in the ephemera as well. So before um, we put together the kit, um, the ephemera basket, I will just cut. Um, all of these so that um, they're all ready for our little craft with me. I'll come back. All right, I'm back and I have um, everything cut. It took a bit of time cutting all of the bits and pieces, but here are the ephemera, the different pockets, the tags, um, the stuff that we'll put inside our pocket. So I'll put these to one side so that we can build our base so these are the picnic basket and floral backgrounds so what we will do is we'll just fold them right down the middle by the way if you see 
my rashes that's my allergies in full swing so apologies for that Just please ignore <laughs> so this is going to be the front and the back and then for this one we'll glue this so that this is the next slide next um side that you will see so let's fold this down the middle first so you have a folder so what we will do is we will stick we will glue this part to this part so it becomes a trifold like that and this is your back but since this is repeated so what i'll do is i'll use this one so that that becomes the other side or let's see if i want to use maybe i'll use this so let's fold this to one side as well and I'll just tear this like that and I'll glue this here so that there's no repeating pattern all right let's glue this down let's glue this down first I mean you don't have to print it back to back if uh, you don't want to let's make sure that it lines up right. all right so that's one side and then let's glue this together make sure this lines up that's what i like about <clears throat> using the tacky glue it doesn't dry right away all right so that's your base for the trifold you have all of the beautiful prints here and then it's the basket all around so now what we're going to do next is glue the um, pockets so front for the front page I used this floral floral pocket and the pockets already have these flaps so all you have to do is just fold them so i really love that it's already in there because it makes it easy to just you know fold and then stick And then I just leave a bit of space so that it's so that the basket is still visible. Then you just add glue to the flaps and then leave it to dry. So that's the pocket in the front. And then in the back, I added the other floral pocket. 
inside this one. Then same thing, add your glue. Leave a bit of space again. that's the back and then this is the front and then for this side this is where we'll add the three um, pockets but let's add in the pockets inside first so for this side I want to use the blue this is what we'll use in the middle this is what we'll use for this side and then I am just looking for the blue basket. Alright, found it. This is for this side. This for the middle. White one for the other flap. So let's start holding these. All right, now for this panel, you actually have a lot of choices, right? So, because you still have this one, you want to add a little bit of interest, or this could also look good. There's another pink, but since this is already a basket background, I don't want to use this anymore. Then what I used in the sample were these um, these ones, then the floral ones. So let's see what we will use. Maybe I'll just add two this time. Okay, so those are your pockets for the trifold in the back. Then you can add in your ephemera. For the handle,
I also have some leftover from the first journal that I made. So this is an off cut. Then this is a double sided one. It's good to have it printed double sided because um, so that when you look inside, there's still print. So what I'll do is I'll cut it here in the middle. So that will be your tag. So the other side, I just glued. So we'll glue this one. Just glue it in the middle. And then the other side, I added Velcro. There. So let me just go get some. So we have the Velcros here. Let's add in some glue. Okay, so let's let that dry for a second. And then the next bit would be assembling all of the ephemera to go inside the um, pocket. So I'll speed up this process um, so you can see what I do um, with some.
So there, that's the finished ephemera basket, the second one. So maybe um, later on, I'll decorate the other ephemera, but for now, this is it. I like that we added those elements in this one. All right, that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I hope you follow along. Um, you will create one of these um, ephemera baskets as well using um, the Paper Cameo Summer Picnic Kit. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!